criteria one. It's From saving a life. Criteria two, on as if they're not breathing normally. To solving a crime. So you'll go from seeing nothing in sand to having an impression. To simply helping others find help. We're out in the community. Uh, we're going to people's houses, we're going to Christ Shop, we're going to Oak Park Mall. High school students from across the region got to see it all. They got a taste of what it's like to be a public servant. And people from all parts of Johnson County government were there to talk about their careers and answer questions, even shatter stereotypes. I've been doing this for about 17 or 18 years. Many students approached corrections expecting to hear about jail, but the staff here talked about other programs. Well, I'm just kind of explaining to them that we are kind of similar to jail, but a little bit different, um, how much different our program is and how it works, how we work on reintegrating them back into society rather than just keeping them in one spot the whole time. More than 3,000 students from 48 high schools fanned out across Bartle Hall. They came from all over the Kansas City region to check out booths from the region's four largest governments, the Core Four. This was the first ever Core Four Youth Career Expo. Many students found it helpful. You get to work hands-on and experience, experience with like things you want to do. Like me personally, I want to go into law enforcement police. She got to see law enforcement up close at this booth for the Johnson County Crime Lab. And this one for the Johnson County Sheriff's Office. We're looking for qualified uh, uh, men and women over the age of 18 to work with us at the Sheriff's Office. Uh, we have a position called a civilian specialist that assists our deputies in day-to-day -day operations. Detective Valdez said it's a great way for 18-year-olds to start a career in law enforcement. Those looking at other careers found plenty to choose from. At the MedAct booth, they saw what they might have to do someday to revive a patient. At Johnson County Mental Health, they got to experience art therapy and got valuable information about careers in mental health. We love um, our job. Learning about careers in public service from those in Johnson County who do it every day.